Well, Aaron, it was in this student parking lot where that gun was reportedly spotted. Police show up, but no gun is found. Doesn't matter. School officials taking it very serious, and they have beefed up security for tonight's game between Alvarez and Hollister. This is a Facebook posting of police activity following Thursday's freshman football game at Alvarez High School. Police responded after an off-duty officer reported an argument between several men and overhearing one of them say he had a gat that's slang for gun. He called us uh, after having seen a gun on one of the individuals uh, involved in an argument. Uh, we responded over there and uh, contacted uh, the two subjects, uh, detained them, uh, but no gun was ever found. Police questioned two men in the student parking lot, a 27-year-old and 18-year-old. Police say they're known gangsters in Salinas who were visiting with family rooting for the Hollister team. Police are positive a gun was seen. And uh, at this point, we do believe there was one. Um, we believe it was probably passed off to another individual. Gun or no gun, school officials taking the incident serious, beefing up security for Friday night's varsity game and getting help from staff of the visiting hay balers. It should be a great time tonight. I'm looking forward to seeing everyone. Uh, and again, I think we're so well prepared and, and we always are, but we're just taking that extra side of precaution just, just to make sure that everyone can feel good and comfortable and come, come with us and have a good time. This isn't the first time guns have been reported on campus following a high school football game. Five years ago in the same parking lot, Ronald Turner, a parent of one Alvarez player, was found with a loaded, unregistered gun. Brian Contreras had just left Thursday's game before cops showed up. And this must have happened about 15 or 20 minutes after I left. It's not the first time, and sadly it's not going to be the last. But what I challenge people is if you're a man and you've got kids, we've got to set the role model for them. We've got to be the example. Now, the clear message coming from police and the school principal to football fans is don't let last night's incident deter you from coming to tonight's uh, football game and enjoying a good game. Again, security has been beefed up, and those involved in last night's incident not very likely to return here tonight. Aaron. Felix, thank you. Selena's police also say they would like to hear from anyone who may have any information regarding last night's incident.